U.S. President Donald Trump has hit out at Islamabad as he defended his administration's decision to cut aid to Pakistan. Uh, Trump said, and I quote, Pakistan does not do a damn thing for us. The U.S. President added that it uh, was Pakistan that provided safe havens so to terrorist to Osama bin Laden. We're going to the two areas uh, Trump said, and I quote, Living in Pakistan, right next to the military academy, everybody in Pakistan knew he was there and we give Pakistan 1.3 billion a year. Laden lived in Pakistan, we are supporting Pakistan. We are giving them 1.3 billion a year, which we don't give them anymore. I ended it because they don't do anything for us. They don't do a damn thing for us, unquote. Now, it was in September last year that the U.S. cancelled its $300 million aid to Pakistan. Washington had claimed that Islamabad was not doing enough against terror groups. It's a big setback, as you would say, uh, primarily uh, on part of the new government or the new administration because uh, we saw that visit uh, being done by U.S. Uh, 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 Secretary of State uh, Mike Pompeo on the 5th of September. And uh, uh, both of the sides, they talk about uh, rebuilding ties and restarting them. But uh, in the wake of that, we see uh, this statement, this big statement coming in from uh, the United States President. Not just that, just uh, last week, uh, uh, the uh, U.S. Special Representative on Afghan uh, 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 peace, uh, peace uh, uh, reconciliation process, uh, uh, Mr. Uh, Ambassador Zalmeh Khalilzad, he uh, cancelled and he in fact postponed his trip and the reason it was given, it was uh, apparently, it said that it was due to scheduling issues but uh, it all adds up now as you look on, uh, as you uh, look out at it uh, on prima facie. So clearly it's a big statement coming in uh, from the United States President, President Donald Trump uh, on Pakistan and we're yet to see the Pakistani uh, foreign office or any uh, politicians even uh, react to it. For Vion, from Islamabad, Anas Malik, World is One. Now, Trump's latest uh, criticism of Pakistan comes ahead of the 10 years anniversary of the 2008 Mumbai terror attacks. It also comes just weeks after Pakistan's record on terror was discussed between Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi and U.S. Vice President Mike Pence in Singapore. The Indian Prime Minister is scheduled to meet the U.S. President during the G20 summit in Argentina later this month.